Luke Palioka told me to make sure I was shooting videos of this here. Who so, did? Luke. Who did? Say hi, Luke. Hey, Luke. Luke is an artist up in Maine. Yeah, I've seen some videos of him. Yeah. Yeah. Didn't he used to work with you racing or something? Or? No, um, but him and I hung out a lot together. He he worked with me helping to build that uh, trailer I built out of a refrigerator. In fact, he gave me the refrigerator. Right, that's right, yeah. Phil. He gave me Phil. Phil the Phil call. Uh -huh. <laughs> so that's not mustard. Don't put it on your sandwich. <laughs> that's you special. Up, huh? That's special sauce for the tractor. That's not for you. <laughs> Don't be. <laughs> Although it wouldn't, beef, sauce, lettuce, cheese, pickles, onion, on sesame seed bun. it wouldn't surprise me none if you didn't take a swig of it, knowing your background. I probably drank worse. Have you watched to make sure that this uh, thing on the end of the cramshaft turns when the motor turns over? Oh, right there? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, I mean, no. I mean, I'm sure it is, but <laughs> just a thought. Um, I'm thinking maybe the time and change. Does it have a time and chain or does it have a gear? It's on a gear. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, we'll see. How's that? Yeah. I'll look. Uh, we can do that readily, readily easy. I'm looking. Battery dead. Oh, it shouldn't be. Well, call the film. Do you have to mash your clutch or anything to get your... Mm -mm. the house. I'm, I'm betting this is supposed to be hooked to the starter. Oh, wow. Yeah, I took it off when I played it. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, you may want to make sure that you get paint off of that contact oh, paint. That would have something to do with it, Richard. Yeah. All right. Okay. Good. I got to tighten up that. Don't let me forget to tighten that up, because. But yeah, I figured it was turning. <clears throat> now what I need to do, if I can visualize it, is this slot is offset. Yeah. Looks to me like the big side's on the bottom, doesn't that look like it to you? Uh, when you say the big side, the longer side is slightly, it's, it's almost it's a little above horizontal, and it's slightly so, above. So the big side of this right here is, is on the bottom, right? That, that should pretty closely match it, right? Oh, the big side. Yeah, see how this side is bigger than that? There's more room here than there is here between See, this is not equidistant. See, there's this is huh. slightly off center. Huh. That's why I'm not too concerned. People say, "Well, you got to always make sure you huh. you mark it." Well, you don't really have to because it's offset. See, it's yeah. it's you can see this side's huh. shorter than that side. And then if you look at the at the slot there, it looks like the big side's on the bottom there. I'm not. I'm gonna let you judge that because uh, you know what you're talking about. Uh, you want a gasket, though, I think. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna put it on first to make sure that's how it'll fit. And you can tell it because I've done, I tried it backwards, and I tried it backwards just on purpose. See, that's a, that's a perfect fit. It just slipped it slipped in there. Mm -hmm. So it's not a. I mean, I can't tell you how many videos I looked at. See, oh, you gotta make sure you check that. You gotta make sure you check it. No. I got blanking. I said, well, it looks like it's different. 
So I searched that and it said, yeah, it is different. Top all the way up and so I tried to slip it in the wrong way. Morning, we're over at Bobby's house and we're going to get the tractor running and he said he's supposed to call you and let you know. So I'm mm -hmm. calling you because he's got his hands full of uh, distributor. Well, I'm going to ride over there and, and socialize. That'd be awesome. I'll see you shortly. See you shortly. <laughs> mm -hmm. Bye. Bless his heart. Bless his heart. Yeah. Good friend. Will's a good one. Always has been and always will be. Yeah. We gotta figure out a way to keep him up here. I don't think you have to figure far because I think he's already here. No, I mean permanently like. Well, I think that may have happened already. Well, I'm hoping. Uh, Dixie and I were talking about that last night after he left. I think he's doing that on his own. Love that man to death. Turn around and look at me so I can get the tractor in the background. Oh, uh, no, I don't want you to look at me. Give, give me a quick look. I'm going to send it to Rusty. And don't look at the back of my shirt. Dixon told me I had a big tear in the back of my shirt. Are you sending this to Rusty? Yeah. Smile. Smile. We're going to get the beast making smoke today. Actually, oh, that was a picture. That oh, was a I picture. Thought, I thought it was a video. No, I'm going to send him a picture. Oh, okay. All right. I think you got the back of my head, but that's all right. I don't guess it would hurt, hurt to take this cap off and look at it real quick, would it? Just be on the safe side. I just know they're paying the neck to get back on. I'm guessing that's gasoline. A starter fluid. It's gas. Okay, I, I went and bought some. One of the guys that does videos he and his daughter does do videos uh, he's got he uses a, a one of those little oil cans and just sprays it in the fuel line well you can use an oil can mm -hmm. uh, I, uh, I've got another bottle a little bottle that I do that with it uh, but I couldn't find it right handy uh, mm -hmm. but the mustard bottle works uh, you just have not to. You just have to be careful because it'll spray more than you want. Yeah. Uh, right, you got those bolts right in my hot little hand. Mm -hmm. so I don't wash it. Mm -hmm. I'm taking this thing off more times than you can imagine. Dang, my hand hurts so bad with this arthritis. Mm -hmm. I think I'm having to give up playing guitar. If you stop yanking off so much, you know, it gets better. <laughs> what do you think I got married for? What's the top of that? <clears throat> How come the top of that looks like it's what? smushed up or beat up or burned or something? It's brand new. It shouldn't be bad. What? That screw right there. Oh, jeez. Looks like somebody hit it with a hammer. Oh, I'm so glad you saw that. I don't know if you're going to be able to get that off there a lot. Let me take a picture of that. Yeah. We might wind up sending that puppy back, but I mean, if we can get it off. I can grind it off with a with a Dremel, but you shouldn't have to do it on something when you buy something new. Well, you shouldn't. Now let's take it off and take a picture of it. No, this. no, leave it on there. I'm going to take it off to you cut the Dremel and get cut it off with the Dremel. Glad you saw that. Of course, we'd have noticed it as soon as we tried to put the wire on it. No, I don't even know if you can get the nut off of it. Yeah, I can. I've got a Dremel. I can cut that off. And... Show me that part where it's scraped up to.
I think it said brand new parts. Well, it is a brand new part. Oh, let me let me see what I can do with it. See, there's supposed to be a slot on it. I'm gonna show that. I'm gonna put it on the YouTube video too. In case we have to use the YouTube audience as a backup. Yeah. <laughs> so YouTube audience, I want you to look at the, this is a brand new part, just arrived, just took it out of the box, and it's been bashed here on this nut. So that, that nut is all banged out and spread out. Looks like somebody dropped it on the floor. Yeah, There's also marks on it, like right there, and right there, and right there, and right there. It looks like, looks just like somebody maybe dropped it in the floor or something before they boxed it up so the bale's got rust on it bale work yeah i don't know maybe i need to take it apart well, let me see that's supposed to be a slot like a screwdriver yeah i know so you can hold it when you tighten that right. that thing down but i'll have to grind that off with my dremel let me let me get that Hmm. So, I don't know. I don't know. Well, another thing we could do, if we can do it, is loosen that and make a notch out of that thing instead of having one that goes over and have one that slips in. That way, if it turns out not to work and we send it back, it won't have these grind marks on it. These grind marks if I send it back, you might say, well, you may. No, you got it. You got a video and a picture of it. So we're gonna try to fix it. If we fix it, then fine. Well, I'm okay. With it. All right. yeah. I mean, yeah. Because you got a you got a video and a picture of it like it was, and we said we're gonna try to fix it and, and save him from having to give it you your money back. Let me see if I can find the email he sent me. See if there's a phone number on that. Okay. Call him up too. All right. You know, worst case scenario, we could try that other coil. But maybe it would be the purpose of buying something new. He starts at 4.30 in the morning. Oh, they don't, they don't cook Dixie looks it up and says, oh, that, that particular chicken is, you could even raise those in a, in a, uh, in an apartment. <laughs> I wouldn't think so. You got a little wrench that'll fit this? Yeah. Um, right here in the middle. One of those, there's, those are all my little bitty ignition wrenches and stuff. You gonna try backing it off and see if it'll straighten it out? I think what we ought to do instead of grinding it, uh -huh. let me go get one of those open end wire clips to put on there. Uh, and another thing we could do before you grind it is I could connect your piece of wire to a, just a clip, a clip on it, and see if we get the firing. Well, I got before we take it in start. I got alligator clips. Because my thinking is, if you've ground on it, you'd love to say, "Well, you did this and you did that, but you got to do it like that." That's yeah. good. You could just take the one of these, stick it on there, put the wire on there, and clip it on, and then spin it over and see if we got fire. If we know we got fire, then we might, like, like I said, find a clip, just find a clip and put on there rather than grinding on it. I don't want nobody to come back and say, well, you messed it up yourself. Well, you got video proof though. But well, I don't, you know how people are. Yeah, well, you can't. You know how the power of the, the internet is. You, you tell the guy to do right or else. 
It don't always work that way, though. Yeah, you do right or else. Haven't stick me before. Yeah, you know, not these guys, but I don't know these guys. But all I'm saying is, don't take nothing for granted. Expect the best, but be prepared for the worst. Expect the worst. No. <laughs> you got it right, bass backwards. <laughs> Ye of little faith. I'm gonna invest in some of those little ratcheting. Oh, those are just best. Those are the coolest things. I know. They're not cheap though. No, I know. To get a good one. I don't know if Harbor Freight has any that are less. You know, I, I've the ones I got are good ones, and man, they cost a lot. I should I should have bought some when I was at Lowe's and when I worked at Track Supply, I'd get a discount on them, but never did. I bought mine before Sears went out of business. Yeah. Cause you can't really get a socket in here. You can, but it's not not worth the trouble. Cause you can run these things in almost all the way, finger tight. That one over there, in good. No, well it's finger tight. Well, I mean it's in the hole though, right? So it's lined up. Finger tight. Mm. You rich it. If you want to. If you feeling froggy. Well, let me forget my duck eggs now. Oh yeah. You know, Dixie said she got me some. I think we got four, maybe six. They're starting to produce them now. And we, I asked her, I said, do you want me to go ahead and put something around the nest? She said, oh no, we don't want any more, any more ducks. Any more ducks. No ducks. Well, this last batch we had was just plain crazy. And I pay you for eggs. Uh -huh. You insult me one more time like that and I'm going to slap you. You ain't going to slap me. I'll, I'll slap you in the next week. You would not. You missed this whole you know episode. That, you here. know that bad things would happen if you did. I need to tell you something too. What? You don't make me slap you. We've been having we've been having this conversation about getting slapped already. Now I don't want you to make me make it a reality for you. Reality is what you make of it. So, it's all hey, how you doing? How you doing? I'm good. How are you? Good. Don't forget my eggs. I haven't forgotten. Wee. Billy's coming over. Okay. Bill Hurst is coming. You might want to hide the kids. I'll be so glad when I get my shop built. Man, I need a plug wire. Oh, we ain't got plug wires. I got them yet. over here. We just need one. Well, I got four. Well, if you stick one on there, I'll stick a screwdriver in it, and then we'll see if it makes me scream like a girl. If it does, we'll know. Which one are you going to use? What do you, you feel like? It? Pick one. Let's use number so one. So what we're going to do is just see if this thing's got far in it before we do anything else. And the way I'm going to do that is, so don't do this on a small car because I might have enough electric <laughs> to cause you to yeah. lose your grandkids. But yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm just going to stick that in there. You're saying that the, the amperage is a little higher? He's going to spin it over and we're going to see if I get shot. Contact. Shot. Now how's that not happening? Uh, is this wire connected to the battery any longer? This wire here that I put that to right there? It's connected to the resistor right here. So has that got fire? It's supposed to. Let's check it and see. You, should, you got Sophie! your... I got my tester sitting over there. I got it. Sophie! No man! That's a good ground right there. Okay, these don't like mine. 
Right. I don't know. What are you doing? All right. I got fire there. Yep. Oh, wait. Yeah, I got fire. There. So why ain't I getting... I don't know. Get my screwdriver again. Don't that have to be grounded? Well, it does if you have a spark plug on it, but I'm just... Oh, okay. I'm just gonna, I'm, I That's am true. the ground. Now that don't make sense. I told Bill the other day. I said you go yesterday. I said you gonna have to get something, a cowbell or something on that thing. You can't sneak up on me like we that. Hear you coming? Yeah. <laughs> got juice. Got juice. But I'm not getting no far. That's the same thing I was getting before. Mm -hmm. But there ain't but one wire to go to that, right? Right. Mm -hmm. That one right there? Right. That's the only one. I should be getting shocked. Nope. Okay, Bill. I'm busy. Huh? I'm busy. I thought he said I'm Billy. <laughs> what did he say? He says he's busy. Oh. What are you busy with? I got a loose screw. Well, we've been doing that for years. <laughs> I knew you'd go there. <laughs> well, that don't make good sense. No. You want to take it off, take it apart, see if it's got points in it? <laughs> yeah. yeah, why don't we do that? Turn this battery off, so, well, I, I just did. Yeah. All right, battery's disconnected. I, I must put it on there so tight you can't get it loose by yourself. I didn't eat my wheeze this morning. All I had was my... If you need me to, I can get Bill Hurst to get over and grab that thing. And all I have is my sausage biscuit, my cu two cups of coffee. You know, he's extra strong. Yeah. I used my deodorant this morning. He used to beat up the big boys on the beach down in Florida back in the early days when all the girls was after him. You know. He'd run them big boys off. I found some pictures the other day of when we used to go down to Daytona when I was a kid. Stay yeah. at the Monte Carlo Hotel. Yeah. And, uh, Got pictures of the cars going up and down the beaches, 63 Impalas and uh, an old box Ford. You remember the old Ford box van? The O'Connell lines, the first ones. Oh, yeah. And uh, pictures of me with my damn crew cut. I wanted so bad to be Johnny Unitas. And I'd go, the barber would say, I'm sorry, son, I can't do you a flat top like Johnny Unitas. This thing's hot. Ooh, it shouldn't be hot. It is hot. We got some resistance somewhere. I mean, all it's connected to is that one wire. Yeah. Oop, drop it. Put your hand on that right there. Just put the flat of your hand right there. Ooh. Get the heat in that. Yeah. That shouldn't be hard. No. I'm. I wonder if the wiring. I don't know what else to do on the wiring. I've done three different kinds. I mean, I'm thinking it's that thing. The coil. I tell you what. I don't, yeah, I don't know. Maybe I don't know whether to take that apart or not. I think we're going to send it back. No, let's take it apart and look at it. Doesn't have points. Yeah, the points are in here. Are they in there? Yeah, you got to take this apart. Does have points. Look at this thing hot. That would mean it's got resistance in it somewhere. That means that something's wrong with the wiring. But the other one never did get hot. Oh, it's only one wire. Yeah. It's either hot or not hot. But it was hot. You put put it on there, it was hot all the time. I know. That's what I'm saying. But it, I don't think it should be. It shouldn't be hot all the time. It should open and close as the I mean it should go cold and hot based on what the points open. The points are open, there shouldn't be a circuit going through it. I don't think. See, because you get 
you get this. Don't, don't talk, just, just keep doing All right, look. This right here is right here. It comes off the top let's of the road take, button. Let's take the one you got sticking on there. Okay. See, that's a brand, looks like a brand new one. David said it was a brand new one. Um, there's no way we could really bench test it or anything. If you could spin that little thing, you could. What, like this little thing? Yeah. Yeah, okay, I can. I mean, you'd have to spin it enough to get it to do something. Well, it doesn't generate. I mean, it, it's either on or off, but you got to have the power hooked up to it, right? You have to have put spark plug wire in it. Yeah. Okay. Well, that might need to be grounded. It probably needs to be grounded because it's got a condenser in there. Ground. Look at that thing and see which way it is now. How Looks you like been? It's about like. Good. How about yourself? Good. It's about like that. <laughs> Have you got a screw? No. What'd you do? It, with it? it dropped. It dropped. It's right there. If you hold it, I'll go. Bill, can you hand me that bolt right there, please? I sure can. Would you? I sure can, buddy. Thank you, sir. You're a gentleman and a scholar. I sure do wish my rheumatologist would get this stuff straight so I can take get this medicine going. Get out there, let me do that. Now you, you really should know better than to say even say that. My hands are bad, but they not, apparently they're not as bad as yours. That was I just wasted. I don't away. whine about mine all the time. Well, so you know what? I'm old enough to where I can whine and get away with it. Well, you can't get away with it with just anybody, and I'm not just anybody. All I'm right, me. I'll see y'all later. You stand around me long enough, and I try to get you straightened out. I don't know if it'll help or not, but you need some straightening. How long have you tried? How long have you been trying? Huh? Let's see now. Yeah, see, I call bluff. 1970. <laughs> I call bluff right think about it. 50. Here, turn the wrench and hush it. How many years has it been since 1974? 48. 48 years. You see how crooked you are? After all these years, you still ain't straightened out. What's it going to take? Huh? 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 See, that goes that way. No, it goes that way. Right. Atta tidy, way. lefty, loosey. But you're backwards, so it needs to be lefty, That's lefty, lefty, said. tidy, lefty, tidy, lefty. That's what I just said. You see me making arm motions in the air so I can figure out which way was what? Well, just turn Don't it, and then if, it, have if it starts you. tightening up, you know you're going the right way. Don't make me have to put up with you now. Just because you got in that hillbilly and think you know everything. See, it's right in my way. She jumped right in there and got right in my way. You seen him, didn't you, Bill? Did you it. seen him do that. Well, you know what? What am I going to do with him? When you're in a pit crew, you got to do what you got to do. Bill, make race car noises. He <laughs> thinks he's in a pit crew. <laughs> that was pretty damn pitiful, wasn't it? <laughs> I thought it sounded pretty good. Well, I figured you, it sounded familiar. It sounded like a Ford race car. <laughs> All right, I need us a, I need us a plug war. I'm tightening that too tight now. No. Righty tighty, lefty loosey, right? So what if y'all took that off and now you're putting it back on? So what, well, what have you we changed coils. Well, we took, coils. see, this is brand, brand, brand new. Brand spiking new, did the same thing. This is it came out of the box. Hmm. And it's got marks on it here and here and this thing down here had a mark on it. It looked like somebody dropped it in the floor before they put it in the box. The box was in good shape. It was double boxed. All right, I need a conductor here. Not you, Bill. Him. <laughs> I'm hoping this still works. I want to hear him squeal like I a girl. I need to feel the power. I want him to squeal like a girl. Do it again. Got to be something in the wiring. Got to be. What do you mean? It's one, ain't but one wire. I know. But maybe since it's, feel this one, is it getting hot? Well, I don't know. See, see if you can tell. 
Well, that could be a bad coil, and this one could be a bad coil. Oh, jeez. Not as cold as cucumber. All right, put put the test light on it and see if it's showing current. Oh, it switches off. I ain't sure where none or yeah. none. Uh -uh. How come? I don't know. Where's it at? What'd you do, Bobby? I didn't do nothing. Is that where it's supposed to be? How come we ain't got no far? No, it goes to this terminal up here. Which one? Right here. How come we ain't got no far? What'd you do, Bobby? Not the battery, because we got it turns over. That cool, it's probably bad. Yeah, but you should hit far. Yeah. Far, far, far. Then there, over to the, to there. Yeah. And then from there, to there, from there. You ain't worried about up there. You got fire. You got fire right there. Yeah. Test it. Show me. Now is this the wire? That's the alternator. Here? That's the alternator. This is the one coming off the points. So why ain't it I'm, got no right there? And there's no, there's no, no fire on it. Okay. I don't know. Well, you're supposed to know. Well, we swapped it. We had it, and then we swapped out the coil. And I, What's that have to do with that? Well, when we swap, we had fire. I mean, we had current. Try it the, now. Well, let's get some fire. Well, we had fire with the old coal, remember? What was that and we swapped the coal, and now we don't have it. What was that have to do with that? If you ain't got no fire right there, you certainly ain't going to have it down here. And you, this this should be like, if this is that wire here, wherever it is, if this is that wire, that should be hot. If that ain't hot, then something ain't right. But see, it was with the other coil because remember you we, you you touched it with your light with your meter and the light came on. We'll make it hot. Let's make it hot. Where's that thing? What thing? You know how he is, Bill. I just have to take him through every little detail of this stuff. Have to show him. Just have to show him everything. Just back away from the tractor. <laughs> All right. Don't you be threatening me with no weapon now. You're gonna burn up the tractor. That might not be a bad idea, but I won't do it. All right, now let me stick my finger back in the water. Let me test the clip down here. Right, we got. Screwdriver. I ground myself just for good measure. Sure you're getting a good ground on that battery, I mean on that radio? That ain't all the way good in there. You sure you got these on the right end? They only fit one way. The boot goes on the on the on the strip on the the, the, the 90 degree goes on the Look on at the uh, spark plug. They don't even stay on there. Well here, put it on. These are brand new plugs, wires. David sent for the care package that he set up. Give me something I can stick in there. A little piece of metal that I can just stick right in the hole. Piece of, huh? These wires ain't making contact. Why? Will Phillips, Will Phillips head screwdriver will do it. That's what I'm getting you.
You ready? Mm. Watch your arm on the fan. Yeah. I'm thinking it's got to be something to do with this wiring. It's got to be. No, no. You got fire down there. What? What more can you? What more can it be? Anything? Well, did it I pulse? had that wire tester in there. Right. Ready? Yeah. Success. <laughs> so what the hell was it? It was a big old electrical shock <laughs> hit me like a wave coming in a tsunami. It's like, whoosh. I saw the good Lord look down and say, oh, oh boy. boy. We, get, we did it. We talked about this all night. I feel like I need to get saved right now. <laughs> okay. Okay. Now so I'm, I'm assuming I'm that we. I'm going to cut this off. I'm assuming that we I'm got fire. Yeah, yeah.